Hey, this is the Bat Hounds, if not the best ASA softball bats there are. Today I'm here to bring you a product review of something called the Softball Slug. This is by Precision Impact. It's a weighted training ball. As you can see, it is about the same size as my 12 inch softball there. Uh, they sent these to me to give an honest review of them. I will show you how I've been using them uh, before I head fully inside for the off season. Uh, and I'll give you some running thoughts here. All right, first we'll go over some general information. So as a weighted training ball, these come in at 15 ounces a piece. A traditional softball is anywhere from six to seven ounces. So just over double the weight of a traditional softball. In terms of size, you have roughly the same size as 12 inch softball as you could see. The outer portion of the ball is made of PVC shell uh, with the interior being iron sand. I'm assuming that, that means durability. It comes with a one year warranty uh, and they say all you have to do is take a picture of one of these if it breaks and they will send you out a new one. In terms of cost, for a six pack of these balls they cost $40. Now in my research for similar products, it looks like this is going to be one of the better deals out there. Okay, let's talk purpose. What are these uh, weighted training balls for? I see two main purposes for these. Uh, the first is to strengthen your swing through the zone. So it's to strengthen those muscles as you drive the bat through the hitting zone. Uh, and forcing it to hit something heavier, but then also mentally to uh, train your brain to use your whole body and force through the zone, strengthening that swing. And then second is to be able to take batting practice or warm up when you don't have a lot of space. So uh, in general, off the tee, I get about 150 feet with one of these. That's including the rolling. Uh, so it's not very far, so you can kind of go out to a lot of places and just swing with these uh, or if it's kind of damp on the field and you don't want to be running out all over the field these are uh, you know a great tool to use at that point all right let's talk likes and dislikes starting with the dislikes can't say that these really qualify for dislikes uh, but i did notice that one of the balls i was using uh, was a little bit less distributed of the material on the in on the inside uh, but i did not see that it changed the performance of the ball um, I also was a little bit surprised by how far I could hit the ball. So it's, uh, you know, I live in the city, as I kind of have a city lot, so it's not a ball that I could really use in my backyard. Um, but that's totally fine with me. But what I really like about the product is uh, how it's extending my season for me, especially with the colder weather coming on. Uh, I can get out and I don't need a huge space, uh, so I can just get out and I'm hitting from the pavement here on a track onto a soccer field and football field so that's nice for me and of course i also love the idea of getting a stronger swing hopefully getting more pop on the ball getting more distance and i'm hoping this will also be a good tool to use in the garage over the off season uh, so it's not so loud uh, always using real softballs all right, let's talk about usage. Uh, one of the things you might have noticed is that I'm going back and forth between the weighted training ball and the regular softball. This is what they recommended in one of their videos uh, because what you're looking for is what they call transference. So in using the weighted training ball, you're forcing your mind and body to really drive through the zone, but you also want to transfer that into a regular swing when you're hitting a regular ball. In other words, you want to avoid uh, creating bad habits uh, by only swinging the weighted ball. So you're going back and forth. So I've enjoyed that method. One of the things I'll do is put cones out there or something to mark uh, a hitting goal, uh, both for the weighted training ball as well as the regular softball. And I will see if I can keep pressing beyond uh, the mark um, when I'm going back and forth. Now, sometimes I see great results uh, where I had 12 of 30 swings with regular softballs were beyond the mark and other times not so much but um, you know this is all a tool to help you get stronger now as I walk to see the results if you get dizzy quickly you might want to close your eyes for a minute here now after using these for a while I can uh, say that I think these are great batting practice balls for small spaces if you're looking for that or if you're looking for a tool to help strengthen your 
your swing and drive through the zone. Uh, seem to uh, have had good results so far, and I'm looking forward to using these in the off season. I want to wrap up this voiceover section by not just only talking about the product, but also saying that this was a great company to interact with. I had several email exchanges with them, and I really appreciated their humility when I asked uh, a question and they, they didn't have the answer to it, and they just said they didn't know. I also appreciated that they referred to this as a tool. Uh, this is one tool to help improve your swing. This isn't automatically going to make you an all-star, but it is one thing to help you. They also have a playlist of some really helpful uh, videos, which I will put in the bottom of the description. Overall, I enjoyed this product. Get stronger and have fun at the same time. All right, so there you can see it. Uh, looks like three out of 12. Uh, made it past the mark, so that's you know one fourth. Uh, happy with that. Uh, so overall, I've enjoyed these so far. Look forward to using them over the off season. See if they can help uh, get me a stronger swing there, drive through the ball. Uh, so this is the Bat Hunt, everyone. Signing off. Be sure to subscribe to the channel right up there. Check out some other videos right up there. Thanks, everybody.